welcome back to our channel. Today we're going to be reading Nickelodeon's Ping Fong Baby Shark, Baby Shark and William's Big Adventure. Baby Shark. Baby Shark is curious about everything under the ocean. He loves to sing and play games. Mommy Shark. Mommy Shark always listens to Baby Shark and shares a special bond with him. Daddy Shark. Daddy Shark is a strong and mighty hunter, but he also plays with Baby Shark like a friend. Grandma Shark. Grandma Shark likes reading. She always has time to spend with Baby Shark. Grandpa Shark. Grandpa Shark is wise and smart. He enjoys sharing his cooking with Baby Shark. Baby Shark woke up with a big yawn and a stretch. It was a new day, and that meant a new adventure. There was so much to do, do, do. Mommy's little shark swam over for a big hug. Good morning, baby shark, said daddy shark. I think you have a visitor. Who could it be? It is William. William is baby shark's best fishy friend. Want to go to the beach for some fun in the sun? William asked. Let's go, replied Baby Shark. Baby Shark and William waved goodbye to Mommy and Daddy Shark and swam off into the deep blue sea. Before they left, Baby Shark grabbed one green pail. Baby Shark loved to find treasures along the ocean floor. If they were going to swim to the beach, they could have an adventure along the way. Before they swam very far, William had already found some treasure. He found two yellow coins, one for him and one for Baby Shark. They put both coins in their pail. Soon Baby Shark spotted three purple rocks. He dropped the rocks into their pail. William saw something sparkling in the distance. He swam close and realized it was a pair of glasses on Grandma Shark. Look at these four blue sparkly seashells, said Grandma. Thanks, Grandma. These will make the perfect addition to our collection, said Baby Shark. See you later, said Grandma Shark. Baby Shark saw five red sea stars. Each one had five arms. They put one sea star right on the front of their pail for decoration. Look, said William, those pieces of coral are the same color as me. They are orange. There were six orange corals. Baby Shark dropped them into the pail. Finally, William and Baby Shark made it to the beach. They picked seven pink pretty flowers for Mommy Shark. They even found a beautiful rainbow. That won't fit in your pail, said a voice. Someone had found them. Grandpa, said Baby Shark laughing. They splished and splashed and played all day. When it was getting close to dinner time, the two friends said goodbye to Grandpa Shark. As they were leaving, Baby Shark spotted a pair of sunglasses in the sand. He put them in his pail with his other treasures. Race you back home, he called to William. Baby Shark and William couldn't wait to show Mommy and Daddy Shark all the treasures they found on their adventure. Mommy Shark loved her flowers. Wow, you found so many things today, said Mommy Shark. You even found Daddy Shark's sunglasses. We've been looking for those all day. Draw some, said Daddy Shark. See you tomorrow, said William as he left to swim home. Thanks for a fantastic day. Daddy Sh Baby Shark yawned as Mommy Shark said goodnight. 
Sweet dreams, she said. Baby Shark dreamed of all the things he would do, do, do tomorrow. The end. Thank you for joining us for today's book read, Nickelodeon's Baby Shark and William's Big Adventure. We hope you guys enjoy the book. Consider subscribing if you're new to our channel. Share this with your friends and family if they're into these types of books. And stay tuned for another book read coming your way soon. Take care, guys, and keep on reading. Goodbye. Bye.